is making a hell of a run. He's got the Steve. Oh, no. He had the Steve bracket. He played uh, into Stefan, the number two seed of the event, and won both of them 2-0 for a chance to make top eight winner side. But, I don't like this. But here we are into a, another top eight qualifier, uh, excuse me, another winner's quarter, excuse me. We're not into top eight qualifiers just yet as C and BD Bean take the stage and both C and uh, their uh, and their cohort, uh, Noku, have been going around local to local for weeks now and putting up big names and big wins on all of them. C just recently making top eight at the last Xeno uh, weekly and BD Bean at the last Fusion making getting uh, getting to third place. So these two are mm. riding a momentum high right now. Um, can I just ask, why are we getting every freaking Wario I New wish Jersey I could tell on stream you. tonight? There's a lot of them. <laughs> Is it, like, I forget how many there are, and but like, like literally, we're getting all of them tonight. Like, good for you, Warios. Like, like, good job. Yeah, New Jersey um, alone keeps the Wario meta. New Jersey and Gucci yeah. keeps the Wario meta alive because there's just all of them are here. Hmm. <laughs> Spiritually, uh, Gluto is a New Jerseyan. Oh, yeah. Um, you saw that dance. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's from Jersey, whether he likes it or not. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but C is looking to make the most out of this matchup. <laughs> trying trying to take the New Jersey out of BD Bean with his Westchester vibes. And this Palutena is looking to try and shut down BD Bean before they can get started. But if there's anything BD Bean loves in a, in any sort of game, it is a scrap fest. It is scramble situations. It is when both players are holding forward because that's when you see BD Bean at their finest. Mm. Oh, <laughs> we're seeing some scrapping for real. What was, oh, what was oh my that? god! What You're, was you that? can't get away with that. <laughs> that was dumb, and and he gets oh away with it because god. he's BD Bean. That's. This is the joke. We're watching the joke in action as the up throw doesn't even take it for C, but the up air certainly will. Uh, I'm still Palutena real. up air, restoring some semblance of normalcy, uh, some semblance of normalcy to this match. And Palutena neutral air, uh, you know, you got hit by neutral air by Palutena and you took 50. This is, this is the tax. Spike comes down, trying to space out with just a forward air and some of these down totes, but He's been doing a very good job of not letting BD Bean get free pressure in the corner with some of these down tilts. Though pressure on shield, on the other hand, that was extremely well done, poking with two down tilts before trying to pressure uh, on the jump out of shield, forcing C to be a lot more patient, except for when these dash attacks come in the clutch. And now uh, BD Bean kind of getting walled out here. Oh, misses the, misses the, oh, what? Didn't have a jump, didn't have bike, did ha had nothing at all, thanks to being two framed by the down tilt. But, down, uh, the down tilt's Great a air bit, dodge. Yeah. Let to dash attack, but not no stock. Oh, take two. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll just All right, back. Funny little bike deck goes on, and the bike falls off the stage. As they, this has been at uh, BD Bean has been at full walk for a solid couple minutes now, but just hasn't found the proper opening to really make the use out of it. As that air dodge was scouted by C so hard. And like you see, you see BD Bean flashing. That like that waft is looming. Oh yeah, he, he's hunting for some of these landing aerials. But sees using, uh, using Palutena's in, uh, insanely good air air mobility as a means to force uh, BD Bean into only being able to pressure with rising aerials. Which don't confirm oh, into no. waft oh, no. really as well. But this platform pressure, those platforms aren't safe. Not at all. Oh, missing the second hit of Nair. And the, okay, that's like that is uh, like that's the double-edged sword that is that is Wario. It looks so good when it hits, but it has to hit. Oh yeah. Oh, it's <gasps> again going for up tilt, but no punish at 130. Gets the crab, misses the. Oh no! Huge, huge whiff. As All right, BDB, and let's see what you got. Yeah, now you have to play the honest game again. Can or as honest as honest as Wario can get. Go and take your stocks like a family man. Yeah, you earn your living wage like a normal person. Oh, and uh -huh. up tilt. Okay. Oh. oh. Whiffing all over the place and trying to punish Dash Attack oh, with forward smash. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> what kind of attempted punish was that? And you can see BDB just shaking his head. It's like overzealous and, o and overconfident in some of the 
windows that he thinks Palutena can give. And even C shaking their head, knowing they uh, he kind of got away with a got away with murder a couple times, falling out of up tilt as well. Total spaghetti at the end of that game. Yeah, his spaghetti is erupting out of the setup right now. It's just vomiting from the Nintendo Switch. Yeah. Oh no, the it's not pretty. Oh, don't touch his spaghetti. Yeah. <laughs> Rising there at the start, but nothing coming of it. And both these two are like being defensive in each other's faces. It's the pro it's the ability. <laughs> it's, it's a good way of putting it. It's the power of having characters with such good airspeed and players with such good punish games is that you know you can get 50 or higher on basically any neutral win. So might as well try and play that game of chicken and BD Bean stands up right into that forward smash and gets away with it. Oh man. And she runs up. Oh man. Okay, you can't. You can't. Like you cannot slow the pace of this game down for a second. No, not not in the mo not in the slightest. Even as an up tilt comes in and a double up air for 72. And this game is practically even. Though the real difference for C is going to be that defensive discipline. They're able to hold shield and basically be unafraid of much of what BDP has been wanting to do. Grab follow ups. Not too scary at these percents against Wario. But bike in, bike in ah. hand, but still not able to recover off the trade in from neutral air. Darn. Dag nab it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I, I like that. Just go right back down there. Like conquer your demons. That, that's. Let's go, BB. Stock needs to fall sooner or later. Mm. Wario can have a little bit of a harder time doing so, especially from a big stage like PS2. Center is. Oftentimes not being BD Bean's friend, though the bike setup was great, except Palutena has an excellent upbeat to just get the right by. Uh, okay. Getting creative. Uh, that was a that was a Pal Palutena hitting BD uh, Palutena hitting Warrior with a stop and frisk there. <laughs> uh oh. Say, get off the bike. I need to ask you some questions. Oh, but Waft wasn't online as. Uh, Wario has no respect for the law and no respect for authority. <laughs> Clearly. Oh man, that one string was so huge. It evened up the game like just like that. And with Waft online, you could really count BD Penis winning this game currently. Especially if they were to, if they're able to find well, the stock first. We we thought we like we thought that about game on game one. Then he missed. You gotta hit it. 0 for 1 on Wafts thus far as a couple to, uh, again, a couple pokes. Uh, oh, BD Bean's okay. shield pressure has just been basically ignored by C, who feels very confident in the fact that after BD Bean won't grab at these high percents, and these down tilts aren't scary because eventually the Wario will retreat. Oh, and Ooh. dropping shield into the explosive flame. That, I don't, that, yeah, I think that was, that, I kind of want a replay of that. I don't know if that was a. I don't know if that's a shield drive or just a shield poke. It was explosive flame just is a mean move. Oh wow! Had the right angle to get to just barely make it back to ledge. This is going to be huge if C can find some uh, extra credit here. Oh, that's time going for the high angled forward tilt as a means for pressure. But this is C 51's starting. very tasty. 65 even better. Yeah, starting to run a train and cutting off Wario from their bike means BD Bean has like basically one or two recovery routes, but that air dodge back to stage does get him back onto... S oh. oh my, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. You can't be ready for that. You can't be ready for like the extended hitbox, uh, like the, the bike extended hitbox waft and then into the catching it with the up air, what? So hear me out, right? Wow. As we get to see this, and I like this idea from BD Bean. It's pretty good. You have wa uh, you have bike in center stage, and y you have an aggressive True. you have an aggressive C as well in that very moment. You're forcing scrambles. You have bike to extend your hitboxes. What could go wrong? Well, <laughs> the because Waft missed in part because Palutena back air is Palutena back air. The the extension on the bike. The, the hit lag that it came from allowed C to react in time to chase. If the oh waft was just God. let rip from center, BD Bean was out of there, waft gone, but in still technically safe. But because of yeah. the extra hit lag, C could use Palutena's insane air mobility and chase down Wario before they could get away. It's straight up for, for <laughs> BD Bean, that's a good play. 
that's a good play. The problem, like the problem, is just Palutena. Yeah, I mean Palutena is just the the ever incumbent force in the meta game. Even when mm. she's technically out of the meta game, she's still in the meta game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like 